Hey everybody, it's Steve with Sky194 and we're here in Barcelona to do a real quick race and basically if you watched my video from last night with my career mode I asked the question should I have gone with an Aston Martin instead of the AMG well I think hopefully we can answer some of that right now um, here in Barcelona I started at the back of the pack and let's see what we can do stay double file Like I said, even last night, this thing sounds so good. You know, only B12 in the whole in the whole field. Like I said, I got did one. I practiced and got my setup under it. Green light. Give it all you got. Another car I like is that BMW. That's a nice car. Well, so far, so good. This thing's cutting through like a hot knife through warm butter. Say hot knife with cold butter. <laughs> I'm just thinking about what's going on in front of me. One thing it doesn't, this car does not like, is braking at the last second and then trying to turn or something. It just it does not like it at all. It likes braking early and then getting set up through the corner. Otherwise, it just understeers like crazy. Man, that sun's bright. Curious to how this does over a longer stint. You know, 15 minutes is super long, but it gives me an idea how you know how it goes. And just like last night, you know, the pit stops were 20, so it gives you an idea of you know, can it go 15 minutes or is the tires totally gone? One thing to Aston is Aston is harder on tires, I think, than a lot of the other cars here. I think it takes a lot to get used to. It's really geared really tall.
basically compared to the AMG, it's like a gear low. You know, you got to have a gear lower. I mean, I could be braking a little bit later than I am. I'm just kind of working my way into it. I don't want to overdo it and end up into running into somebody. Like I said, it's just, it's just, I don't know, it just, it just doesn't do the greatest when you're smashing the brakes all the time. I mean, I guess, I mean, you gotta smash the brakes, but you know, I mean, what I'm trying to say is basically, this, if you're smoother, if you try to be a little smoother, it seems to reward you better than being really aggressive. Come on, Audie, step on it. Fight me. That's what I want. See how it how it compares. What's the eleven? And I had a question for everybody out there. If they would, uh, you know, I was thinking about doing a Comparo, more, more of an in-depth, you know, review of all the cars here in ACC. But I didn't know if anybody's interested. I mean, I don't mind doing it. It's, you know, fun to, to mess with them and see how they react and see what's one different from the other. But I didn't know if anybody would be interested in any of that or not. So if you could leave any comments below, I'd really appreciate it. You know, if you like it or no, or just really care about that or not rather watch just the racing and I got some more car reviews coming uh, I should say model car you know the die cast and things like that that's, that's coming Hopefully the graphics are good for everybody. I uh, worked really hard on the settings, trying to get the maximum out of it, but not, but still get 60 frames. And I've done a lot, a lot, a lot of behind-the-scenes testing and messing around with this setting and that setting and all that. And I'm trying to get the most out of it, but but still keep the you know frame rate 
good because you know graphics don't mean really much to me if you, the frame rate stinks. So. Car is so fun. Well, that didn't work out. Whoa. That was a good one. See if I can push it a little bit. See if I can get back up there. Eh, turning too late. The tires are starting to get greasy, I think, or something. It just doesn't feel like it's responding. Gotta, you gotta turn in early with this thing. I hate this part of the track. gotta drive your adjust your driving style just gotta turn in earlier and things like that because the car just doesn't react like the Porsche or the AMG and things like that I barely touched him man alive what is it picky late there.
What does everybody think? I should have gone with this instead of the AMG. Probably so. At least at the tracks that I'm at. Right, man. Leader is on the final lap. Give it all you can. And all the tracks that I'm at have long straightaways, and this thing just loves us. Loves that. Oh, last lap. I still like the AMG. I might have been faster with this. Who, who, who knows? Some good lap times. 147s aren't, aren't bad. At least, I mean, for me. Again, I appreciate any support, and if you could hit the like button and, and share it, and subscribe if you haven't subscribed, I would really appreciate any kind of support or any input or feedback like on the questions I ask. Uh, again, I would greatly appreciate it, just to, just to try to always improve stuff, and, and uh, put stuff on there that people want to see and would like to see. Appreciate everybody stopping by and All right, check checking the, the video out. You did the best you could. I'll bring the car back. I hope you all enjoyed it. I love listening to this thing. I could listen to it all night long. Um, but I appreciate it, and I hope you come back and visit again. And y'all take care. See ya.